Hey guys, this is the enclosure of my common toad, or buffo buffo is the scientific name. Uh, this is one of two species of toads we have in the UK, the other being the natterjack toad, which tends to be a lot rarer. I have seen one twice in the wild. This particular female is a wild caught individual, however, however, before you get mad at me, I rescued this from a friend of mine, um, basically, a friend of mine's little brother found this girl in the garden and proceeded to pick her up, bring her indoors uh, and try and keep her as a pet in a little, <laughs> it's very cute, just like a little just plastic tub, no features, no substrate, nothing. Obviously the, the boy's parents found out and threatened to throw the animal away or, or, or I, think, I think they threatened to kill it. So my friend told me about this, said would I take it, rescue it basically, and I said yes. I told the, uh, her brother that he could come and, and, and see it and stuff and I'll take good care of it and all of that. Because I, I've, I've looked after amphibians before, I used to have a couple new. As you can see, it's very simple, no heating, no lighting needed, very, very simple, just provided one hide, um, substrate, deep substrate, because they do like to bury themselves, some sphagnum moss, which is live sphagnum moss, and a water, a water bowl which is large enough for her to soak. But yeah guys, I hope you enjoy the feeding clips that I have for you here, and uh, that's pretty much all I have to say. Oh, one final thing, I never condone uh, taking wild animals from the wild and trying to keep them as pets. In this circumstance, I know I could release her, um, but I'd, I've kind of grown grown a little fond of her now, she's, she's very cool, very relaxed, um, I love, she's very cute as well. She's a big girl, she's a very big girl, you might be able to tell by the video that she's, she's got quite a big size to her. Um, and yeah, so I've grown quite fond of her, so I don't really want to get rid of her, but I, I don't condone keeping wild animals at all, never do, never have. Um, some of my inverts are also wild caught individuals, but there's not a lot you can do about that. That's Unfortunately, that is how the pet trade works. Um, but yeah, this isn't, it, it, this I consider a rescue, so I, I don't feel too too much of a, a way about that but I just wanted to clear that up in case anyone wanted to send me some nasty message about oh why are you keeping yeah that's why one final thing so the common toad can be found all over Europe some places of Asia uh, Western Asia as as well as Northwestern Africa also have small populations of the buffo buffo toad uh, also I change the water in her water bowl twice a week on average twice a week